Hey guys, Accountability Angel here, and we are outside of the Shanahan Municipal Center in Shanahan, Illinois. It also appears to be the home of the Shanahan PD. I saw a bunch of squads, so I want to check them out before going to get my complaint form. And roaming around in these different areas really does a number on your allergies. All right, this is um, also one of the same things I was doing that Tara Queens was harassing her in her uh, her counter no stalking order that she's trying to get. I actually reviewed the tape that she's claiming it was on. And, well, that's for a different story, but um, pretty much. The only car I went around was the one that I'm pretty sure was the sheriff's car, which is perfectly legal. Even if I was right outside her own personal car. I don't know if like camping outside there or something, that's a little creepy, but we never did that. We have been doing well so far today overall. Had a little, little bit of a Creepy Mrs. Officer, who I believe was saying something to a Liz woman at the last place, but besides that, they overall left me alone. There's a nice little walking path right here. It's actually kind of like, who the hell's keys are those? Actually seems to be a, not a bad PD so far. We're only uh, not two minutes in yet, so we'll see. Got that. Wonder is this part of the same building? I don't know. You know what? We're gonna find out. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's all the same building. All right, we came up on this side of the building. It says it's the administration, so we're going for this. Enter only. I think the PD might be at the other door, so whatever. We are just a few miles outside uh, the city of Joliet. Just like the first bigger town before we get towards the city. I spotted somebody looking at me in that window. sandals to wear today. Actually, before I go this way, I'm going to talk to her. I have a feeling that might link up with the PD. Hello. Is this where I would find the city ordinance book? You need the city ordinance book? Yeah, I need to inspect it. Okay, give me just a moment. Okay. Since it's all connected, I figured I might run into the PD going that way, so I figured, figured to wait. Oh, they actually, looks like these are the newer ordinances. They actually have them up here for us, as they should.
Look at this, guys. There's a cruise in the benefit bracken. Says he has a brain tumor. Poor guy. Anybody up in this area, be sure to get out there June 20th, 10 to 3. Help out that little guy. We also have Mother's Day, Father's Day walks. Here's that in case we need it later. Okay, thank you. I heard something. been inside probably six or so minutes after asking her so it's taken a while to get a uh, book that's supposed to be readily available I couldn't figure out what that spelled at first but apparently it says Shane Han <sighs> they better hurry up or I'm going exploring Okay. Perfect, thank you. We got a big one. All right, guys. Let's see what they got to offer in here. Looks like a whole lot of rules. Police officer there. Electric service fifty five. There's forty General offenses. Let's see what they got. Okay. Oh, yeah. Sorry guys, I'm trying to not shake it.
Part of it's me and part of it's the table. We need it there. Yeah, could okay. I possibly get two Freedom of Information Act um, request forms too, please? Oh, sure, one moment. Okay. She seems pretty nice. I have to ask her her name. Perfect. Thank you so much. And what was your name, honey? Stephanie. Stephanie, thank you so much for being kind and courteous. You too. All right. Stephanie did a good job, guys. All right. Shanahan Municipal Center. I will call that a good pass. You can thank Miss Stephanie for that. She was kind and courteous, got the book for me. Took a few minutes, but she got it, and it was huge. Um, gave me no issues, no issues about me filming, no nothing. Very proud of that. What day is it? Why is that down there? Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, I thought that said something. Let me check the other side. But we will see. We're going to go over to the police department next, right on the other side of the building. In memory of the men and women of this community who served their country to assure the American ideals of liberty. It's from 1970. Alright guys, but it's getting pretty windy out here, so I'm going to cut this one off and probably not turn the other one on until I'm inside or almost inside because the wind's kind of messy. Alright, bye!